I don't care. Like, I just, I don't know. I'm in a funk right now. I need to go. Welcome back to a new vlog. Well, start of a new vlog. It is Friday, and I need to get my hair done. And shout out to Kalani Hair, Kalani Hair. I'm not sure how you say it. In half but a they moment, turn left on to go. Will be sponsoring this video, so thank you so much. Um, my hair appointment was at nine this morning, but she changed it to five thirty. And I was on my way to go get some breakfast, but I ended up getting some coffee this morning. Um, I ended up getting some coffee this morning. They came out with some peppermint mocha. Um, it must be like now time to get back in the holiday season. Hold on, y'all. But it's been rerouting me everywhere. But the police been on every fucking entrance of the fucking highway. I wanna hold on move my phone now because he ain't not finna arrest me. But um, proceeds to film. Um, but what was I about to say? Yeah, so this morning, y'all, y'all know the election is going on right now. And it's just a stressful time. It's been a stressful time this whole 2020, y'all. Like, literally the whole fucking 2020. And, um, so this morning... Well, I seen a uh, influencer that I follow. Stop sign. Um, she did this, and I was like, oh my fucking God, that is so fucking sweet. Like, instantly. I was like, I want to do that. Like, But basically, on Starbucks app you can like do like a gift card or something and um load it or whatever and then like anybody can use the barcode so i was like oh my god i want to do this for my girls like i love that okay we don't have time for conversation i wonder what happened on this road anyway so i ended up doing that for y'all this morning and y'all went crazy like i was gonna do it turn yesterday right, but i'm like you know what i'm gonna do it when people right, are on their way to work the and you know i can make their morning so that's what i did i ended up putting it on my story and i reloaded the car like three times because it was going so fast and i asked y'all not Proceed to be greedy y'all was getting the venties and like Proceed breakfast to the food which is cool but Proceed to the root. i mean we, you got to think about everybody else so proceed to the root girl reroute me please you know i can't get on the highway but yeah so Proceed to the root okay <laughs> but um yeah i ended up doing that it was fun i just love seeing y'all happy like because y'all make me so happy and i just love to like get back to y'all and show Proceed my appreciation um and also like i route. did a giveaway and on twitter people were upset because you know it could only be one winner y'all bitch it can only be one winner and a lot of people were upset because they didn't win like i don't understand um like if somebody else Turn left onto Golf Hills Drive. If you would have won and somebody else wouldn't, like I don't know, like it's hard to please everybody. But like I said, um I love giving back to my subscribers and if you are a frequent face and I know um that you support me a hundred percent and I will definitely like make yourself known and I know that you're the diehard supporter like there will be no question for me like to not notice you you know what I'm saying the girl I chose she's um always under my pictures da -da -da -da. she got everything right like some of y'all wasn't even getting the question right for me sitting in the back seat oh my god look at this view y'all it's cute it's like that is so cute oh my god i'm just enjoying this damn that's a nice ass house um <laughs> yeah that's i wanted to show my appreciation but i just uh, for the people that was complaining i really don't like to take stuff out on like my real supporters that really understand and get the concept or whatever so i was like i want to do something so when i instantly seen homegirl um one of my um People that I follow, I was like, oh my God, I want to do that. So I did it. So I will be doing that again. So make sure y'all tune into my stories. Um, Don't miss out. And yeah, so that was fun. It really made my morning to see people happy. So 
but yeah so later i will be getting my hair done um i can't wait look at my hair it's such a mess and i don't know plans right now i'm going back home i'm gonna go take a shower i'm on my menstrual cycle she just came and um i hate being and it's crazy because lately i haven't been having no appetite my faja has been so tight y'all it just doesn't make me eat like because when i do eat i feel bloated and just um being in my faja is uncomfortable but i just had some coffee too <laughs> so i'm like no see y'all i gotta get out mm -mm. anyways i will talk to y'all once i get to my hair appointment or later on or something i don't know but i gotta find my way back home hey y'all good morning it is saturday yesterday i didn't get my hair done because i was late and i i just had a lot to do so she let me come today because she had an opening so which is cool um but oh my god y'all like king bond is dead like that shit is really just mind-blowing like not even just him like even a lot of people from my hometown this morning i seen that somebody got uh shot at last night like it's just so much happening in 2020 y'all like you literally cannot take life for granted <clears throat> and i was just talking to my friend the other day like i'm just like you know what i'm just gonna live life like it's my last like i don't even give a fuck about the price if i want it i'm getting it if i want to do something i'm gonna do it like because at the end of the day you cannot keep you cannot bring no money with you you can't bring shit with you when you leave this earth so it's just like cherish the moments that you have in front of you cherish the people that you have in your life do not get into it with people like that you love for real because you really literally never know like what's gonna happen in a few hours in a few weeks the day after that like it's crazy as fuck to think about like like damn this world is crazy like 2020 is literally like i can't believe i'm living through this shit seriously and what the fuck is going on at the cheesecake it's a long ass line they must be giving out free cheesecake but um yeah i'm on my way to my hair appointment i'm gonna stop and get a smoothie real quick because i don't know how long this is gonna be but i'm gonna stop at urban beats this is my favorite like place to get a smoothie and i'm about to get that so okay period oh i thought he was jamming but yeah y'all so today's saturday hopefully i get into some nice plans today uh i don't know what i have planned for today i want to do something though just to lift my spirits up and just do something um but yeah so i'll probably check in with y'all once i get my smoothie and show y'all what i got and yeah i don't want to take y'all in here because i just don't feel like it. i just want to get in and out so i'll talk to y'all once i get that my lips are like not i love my lips they like a little brat's dog like i love lips like this ah it's been a long time coming
it's been a couple of days. I got my hair done. And that night, I had ended up going out to dinner with Keisha. And we just caught up or whatever. I was trying to vlog, but my camera was not charged. It died. No, actually, it ran out of space. Yeah, it ran out of space. So, yeah. So, anyway. So, today, it's been like a couple days later. And I wanted to show you all my boots I got from Zara. Because I've been on the hunt for some, like, really good, like, everyday boots. And I've been struggling because I wear a size 10, y'all. I wear 10. And I don't want my feet to look big, like, in the boot. Like, y'all know boots are already big. So, if, like, you get a large size, they'll look too long and weird and crazy. But I think I found, like, a good, perfect pair, pair for now. Um, I just unboxed them. But this is one pair. I think they are so adorable with, like, some leggings and, like, a cute jacket. I feel like these will go perfect with that. And then I had ordered these for the second time. They kind of look long, don't they? See, this is what I'm talking about. I had to order um, a different size. I had a size down because I had ordered a size 10 but it came as a 41 and i guess in zara size that's like a size 10 so i ended up ordering a size 9 um and they look fine like these look better on my feet than these but i'm about to show y'all right now okay so this is the boots that i like really cute <sighs> i think they're so adorable like Oh my god they don't look long i mean they're a boot so they're gonna look like you know bulky but the bulkiness makes it not look long and they're comfortable like they're not tight and i have really narrow feet i mean really wide feet and this is narrow but it's not suffocating my foot where i'm like oh my god i cannot walk in these show y'all see how these look long and just not cute i don't know i think i'm gonna return these I don't know y'all but I really like these for like just to throw on they're not shiny they're just I don't know like an everyday throw on boot but they really make my foot look like I don't know I just don't think they look flattering on me what do y'all think let me know down in the comments I already know I already like these so I don't care what y'all think I'm keeping them about these but these ones though and what else i'm about to film a video right now um y'all been dying to know where this green coat is from it's from his guided um and i'm about to film that i gotta get some work done and then also i gotta go retake my savage x fancy photos because y'all i don't know if instagram was hating on me but i don't i don't want to say it was somebody that was hating on me but i think somebody was hating on me on my savage x fancy photos they looked it so good I'm going to insert them right here, but if they get flagged off YouTube, they're getting removed. But if you didn't see them, um, but <laughs> yeah, if you didn't see them, I apologize for just make sure you have your post notifications on on Instagram so you can see the content. But I had got flagged, they had got deleted, and I did have to make a post for them, so I have to go retake them. Um, because I only took it in the one outfit, and those are the pictures that I liked, so... Yeah, I have to go retake them tonight. <sighs> Such a bummer because I'm like, wanted to check that off my list, but now I have to redo it. And they said, I showed them, I gave them proof that I was getting flagged. I don't know what's happening. And what's funny is when I was emailing the girl, she was like, oh my God, somebody has too much time on their hands. I'm like, I'm no girl. Like, this is, this is serious. Like, this is crazy. Like, why am I getting flagged? So... And, like, all these Instagram girls have their booties out. Um, there's influencers that work with Savage X Fenty that got their booty out. Like, I don't understand, like, why am I getting flagged? Like, I don't understand. Because I've been working hard and, like, taking pictures and stuff. Like, people just don't know how much time and work and thought goes into, like, pictures. Because I really had to think about how I wanted the pics. I really wanted them to be, like, a Polaroid type of thing like I really wanted to do good and it's just annoying that I have to retake them 
but it's okay because i'm gonna come back 10 times harder so it is what it is and thank y'all for y'all love and support y'all kept telling me like repost repost we got you we got you and i just love that like that made my heart so happy like literally when i got reported y'all i wanted to cry like i was like oh my god like i gotta retake them and these were so bomb like when you get like a bomb instagram picture and they just do numbers like it just it was just going up like literally like it was just doing so good, but <sighs> y'all, like, I was so pissed. Like, I want to cry for real. But they're letting me retake them, so it is what it is. I just gotta stay focused. So, but yeah, I'm about to do that, and I'll probably see y'all once I get to the location where I am going to be taking them. And yeah, so we're gonna get lit tonight. Hey. <laughs> but I'm about to film this haul. And I'll talk to y'all in a second. Hey girls, so I just got my work done. I love the haul that I filmed y'all. But anyway, so now I'm at my second location. Gonna start some more work with the Savage X Fenty. And this is the room that I got. Um, I get hotel rooms because first of all, when I move, I'll probably be better. Um, like it'll be better aesthetic or whatever. But um, Savage X Fenty, I feel like you just gotta mix it up and have be creative and stuff like that and i wanted to you know get a space where i could be creative like come up with like a look for like the photo and stuff because i am a content creator i get excited about shit like this like i love creating content like i just love it like i get so excited when pictures come out good or like when my vision just is like bomb like it comes out really good so so this is the room i stayed here before um because i took some pictures it was before i got my body done though but so this is like a cute little couch i can probably take like a picture on look at that dog y'all it looks kind of real but um so yeah so this is what you can kind of see in those apartments let me zoom in that's like freaky that's not even an apartment and then it's this long hallway right here. I like this room way better because of the hallway. And then you have a mirror right here. Let's check the body. Make sure the booty is still popping, you know. And then this is my favorite part right here, which is the tub. I think the tub is so cute and I just love it. I'm gonna take pictures in here too. And then this is the bathroom. We're about to get ready. The light super cute in here and then we have this red cute chair i can probably take a picture on you know this is so open like i love it and then this is the bed so all oh, these paintings are real cute too so so i'm gonna let my camera charge and i'm gonna get ready for this little late night shoot and i gotta um what is it? I gotta, um, what is it? I gotta, um, oh, I gotta redo a video, y'all, because my video got copyrighted. But my camera's dying, so I'm gonna charge it and we're gonna get ready for this little shoot. And I hope it comes on good. And I hope it does not get flagged when I post it on Instagram because I don't have time for that. So, yeah. so i just got done with my makeup and it's so cute i actually was on instagram live doing it um it was fun but you know it was a little trolly like geez should y'all be sleep geez but anyways i'm about to start shooting and i'm gonna show y'all like some little behind the scenes so i'm gonna go and do that right now i'm gonna change first and then we don't get into it <laughs> Good morning, y'all. It is the next day, and I woke up early to upload a video. And also, 
I gotta check out this room, but I had to finish some content that I have to do. And I'm about to take a picture on self-timer. I'm about to take my own pictures for the first time in a while. But I gotta get it. Like, it's so fucking cute, y'all. Like, I'm about to show y'all. I just did a practice shot naked because I got done with my, like, Fenty stuff. And I wasn't I wanted to make sure the lighting was good. And I'm like, just because I didn't want to waste my time um, doing it. And it's ugly. But it's actually not. So I'm about to get a cute picture real quick. Just to see. Yeah. And this set that I got on is so fucking fire. Like... It's so fucking cute. Ugh. And I'll be sure to have my Savage X Fenty link in the post because y'all need to go shop because like dead ass, like not even no flex. This shit is bomb. Oh, it's inside out. And after this, I'm gonna go to go get me some breakfast. Breakfast for one, like it's nothing wrong with going out to breakfast by yourself. So. Hey y'all, so it's a little later now. Y'all know them days when you just really don't give a fuck, like today i don't give no fuck like i'm just trying to eat anything like i don't even give a fuck like if it's healthy or not <sighs> i just had to cut a nigga off like i just do not give a fuck and it's raining outside and i'm just don't i don't care like i just i don't know i'm in a funk right now i need to fucking do something but oh my god y'all unghetto matthew is so funny like, he is so fucking hilarious. Like, the shit he be doing, I kind of want to do. Like, he went to McDonald's and um, he, he he put on a fake McDonald's outfit and worked at a couple of McDonald's or acted like he was an employee. And I was like, oh, my God, I think I want to do that. Like, let me know if y'all would want to see me do that. Like, I would literally go, like, in there with, like, a fucking McDonald's work outfit on. <laughs> and be like i'm here for my shift do y'all want me in a register or do you want me on fries like what y'all want me to do so let me know in the comments if y'all want me to do that i dead ass would i'm literally getting bored with youtube and i kind of want to like spice it up a little bit y'all know me i really like to spice up my channel but yeah i want to spice it up a little bit but i'm outside my house y'all know when y'all get to i don't know if a lot of people do this but i do like when i get home I'll sit in the car for like a little bit and vibe out. But I just don't feel like getting up today. Like I don't know what's wrong with me. <sighs> I think I'm just tired. And I don't know. I'm just ready for a pause for like five seconds. I'm about to go in the house and do some work. And yeah, so I'll probably talk to y'all um later but i'm about to finish watching this video he uploaded a video where uh couples have to switch phones and it's like a loyalty test that shit is hilarious like people be, i'll be like give me his phone first like we going through everything quick fast him with flash and you only got like 60 seconds to go through the phone it's so fucking funny but anyway i'm about to finish this going to the house and i'll probably talk to y'all in a second good morning girl today is wednesday it's eight o'clock in the morning um i'm on my way to my massage i probably have to hold my camera because this thing is bouncy and i do have my seatbelt on it's just behind me so i'm on my way to my massage um and it's in Chicago, if y'all did not know that. So I have to get up early. I have to drive two hours to go get my massage. But it's definitely worth it. She definitely keeps me on track. And she coaches me on how to... Well, she's been coaching me on how to compress like for a while now. Especially in the beginning. Um, 
when I had like fluid and stuff still. I still have a lot of swelling when I don't wear my faja. And also I still have like my stomach feels hard as like fuck at the bottom. Because when I wear my faja, it doesn't compress me how I want it to. I know y'all probably tired of me saying faja and shit. But listen, this is what I have to do. This is my lifestyle now. So, and a lot of people are here for my BBL. So, and a lot of people are getting BBLs 2020. Everybody's getting their body done 2020. So, I'm telling you, you need to keep up with your massages. Because it's going to keep your body in shape. Like... This is a lifestyle now, so it's just like I have to do it. Like it's no if ands or buts. Like I, it's never like ugh, I don't want to go get my massage. It's like I'm going to get my motherfucking massage because I'm gonna look good. Okay, so that's what it is, and I feel so much better today. Like yesterday was just a fucking foul ass day. Like I don't know what was going on with me. And then I uploaded the vlog. Some of y'all liked the vlog, but some of y'all didn't. The only reason I did um mostly music and vibes is just because when i went to ancient baths y'all wasn't finna see who i was with like but i wanted to show y'all but y'all wasn't finna see who i was with so i'm like okay i'm gonna make this like a montage whatever the fuck like i'm gonna show them but not no voices no shit and um i was like fuck it i'm gonna just make the whole vlog like this just to see you know the vibes and y'all didn't like it well some of y'all did some of y'all didn't but I didn't understand. I didn't know y'all liked me talking that damn much. So, but yeah, it was just a little experiment. But whatever, it's a new day. And yeah, so I have a few things I have to do today before I go out of town. I have to go get some hip pants hemmed and I need to go to Zara. I gotta return some shit and I might end up buying something like always. Well, hopefully, I know. And um, yes, I do have the same stuff that I have on yesterday. This is Skims, so, and Skims is expensive, so I'm gonna repeat what the fuck I wear. I don't care. But I'm not dirty, so, don't get it twisted. And what else am I gonna do? Oh, I need to call European Wax Center and see if I can get my legs waxed. That's what I need to do. And, yeah, so, I don't feel like shaving. I just don't. I'm not in the mood and also I have a membership there or something. I don't know. Oh my god, it's already fucking Wednesday and tomorrow's Thursday. Fuck. And I gotta find somebody to do me a ponytail. Cause when I go out of town, I do not want to wear a wig. Like I just don't. I just don't feel like itching. Like wigs is cute until you have to put this shit on and then you start sweating and stuff. But let me see the degrees on where I'm going. Yeah, it's gonna be hot. So, I don't want to deal with it. Okay, so. <sighs> but y'all, I love waking up early. I wish I had time to get a coffee. I kind of do because we go tardy. But, um, but no, I wish, um, what was I going to say? I wish I'm going to probably check in with y'all once I get to Zara after my massage. So, I'll see y'all then. When I get the strength to leave you And I'm weak cause I believe you I know this lady was looking at me Damn it, y'all That will forever be a classic in my eyes Period Like I just told y'all yesterday I had to cut a nigga off Like Like dead ass Like I can't do it Like And then I'm at the point where I don't want to argue no more Like for what? It's a waste of breath I'm not the same color when I get mad at my nigga like i'm just like oh okay next like i'm just like no mm -mm. next cut a nigga off i need some coffee i need a breakfast sandwich like or something Ugh. some new stuff on me today she did like a machine or something like that um so like three different machines so um so yeah i feel good so now i'm about to go to get some lunch because i'm hungry 
and I'm gonna go to Can't Believe Us Not Meat because she came out with a new sandwich and I want to try it so and I love vegan like I will eat vegan if it's done right like I love um vegan food if it's done right like seasoned and you know it like tastes like regular food like you know like a regular meal and I'm gonna get a green smoothie from there because last time I was there she got a green smoothie it was good so I'm about to go there now support black business by black baby by black and it's by my girl fab she's the owner and i wonder if she's gonna be there today uh, but yeah so i'm just so in a better mood today y'all like and then um yeah and then i'm gonna get a coffee on my way home after i get so I will check in with y'all once I get to the restaurants. I can't wait to eat. I'm excited. Gotta feed the vet, you know? Okay, y'all. So I got my food. I'm about to wet wipe my hands. Oh my gosh, she's so sweet. So I had ended up um, making an Instagram post on my story, and she called the shop because I know the owner. And she called the uh, restaurant. She's like, "Oh my god, give her some free shit." And I'm like, "You did not have to do that." But I did have to come try the sandwich though, the new sandwich. It looks like a Big Mac, so I had to come try that out. So, and then she ended up giving me a milkshake too, cause I got a green smoothie and I got a pizza puff and a sandwich. So let me try both before I hit the road. Okay, um. You know I'm gonna see how long they that shit. See what is what it looks like. It looks so fucking good. Oh my god. Everything here slaps. I damn near tried everything. I tried the shrimp. I tried I tried the shrimp. I tried the Philly cheesesteak egg rolls. I tried the regular burger, the tacos. Everything is so good. Mm. And it's crazy. This not me, y'all. And it tastes so good. Like, wow. This shit tastes so fucking good. Like, mm, mm, mm. Oh, my God. <laughs> 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. Okay, let me try the pizza puff. comes a piece of sauce. It's a whole mukbang going on. It's going on in here. Okay, so this is what the pizza puff looks like. Regular pizza puff shit. If you have not tried a pizza puff before, you need to try one. Because it's probably the best thing ever. Oh! Mm, God, it's hot as fuck. Slap. That shit hot as fuck though. This is fresh out the um you made. That's why. Let me let this go down. I got a green smoothie. Um they're um I like their green smoothies, but she let me um get this cookie monster shake. It's a vegan. It's none. It's a vegan milkshake. Oh my god, this lady parked right next to me. She can be all up in my reach. Um, 
That's crazy. This tastes like a regular fucking milkshake. I don't want to be extra because the lady next to me. <laughs> See, this why I gotta have somebody with me so they can share all this food with me. Mm, 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 mm. Hi, so I'm about to finish my food and I'm about to be on my way to Zara um because I gotta return my stuff y'all know when food is so fucking good you can't stop eating it that's me right now so I'm about to uh, um finish my food and then I'll probably see y'all once I get to the next mall but yes, if you are in Chicago and you like vegan food, but if, if you like food in general, you don't even have to be a vegetarian. Come to Can't Believe It's Not Meat because this shit is amazing. Like, it's black owned, so you know the shit finna be lit. Like, the food is finna be on point. So, because black people know how to season, okay? So, I'm so fucking greedy. It don't make no sense. Yeah, no. Fuck these. Fire. Herbal wine. Herbal wine. Oh, oh my fucking god. My foot is asleep. So y'all, I have the worst headache right now. I took like a little nap. Um Oh my fucking god. I need to get in a fucking shower. Um I took a nap when I got home after I got my pants tailored. Oh my god, I have the worst headache. But I haven't been drinking a lot of water today. Uh but or I didn't take my vitamins. So I'm about to take all my vitamins and uh, yeah, I hope I just do not have what you call it again because if I do, I'm going to be fucking pissed. Ugh. But yeah, I need to get in the shower. I need to get my life. I'm about to take all these vitamins real quick. And get in the shower. And yeah, like, I just cannot function right now. And I got my glasses on because I thought it could be like my contacts making my head hurt. But... The fuck? Oh my god, let me get some water in me. But I hope it shouldn't be whatchamacallit again because mm -mm. I've been safe, I've been sanitizing, I've been wearing my mask. Um, and yeah, so I don't know if I'm gonna end this vlog off here because tomorrow I just need to get ready, start getting ready for my trip. So, I don't know if I'm going to bring y'all with me for that, but yeah, so I'll probably see y'all in the next vlog, which will be Miami, um, a very spontaneous trip, and y'all see who I'm going with in the vlog, so. Good morning, y'all. I know I said I would end in the vlog last night, but I have shit to do today. So I might as well keep vlogging. So it's the morning time. It's like um, 9 o'clock. I got to hurry up because I got a nail appointment at 10. And then I get my lashes done after that. And then I got to get my toes done. But um, a lot of y'all were asking me about the lymphatic drops that I use. Um, I actually lost them. But I um, just I misplaced them somewhere. But now I found them again. So this is the lymphatic drainage uh, drop that I use. I put 10 to 15 drops in a bottle of water every morning. And I um, drink, and then I just put it in like a water bottle. And then, what else? I do it before I go to bed too. But I'm about to take my vitamins right now. I literally take vitamins every day, y'all. Like, I need to. That's probably why I was having a headache yesterday because I was not eating. But... I don't have corona so because it went away right away after i ate something and took my vitamins and put some water in me i was dehydrated i wasn't drinking water 
uh, yesterday. So I do take the Beam, the Revive. I think I did a sponsorship with them, but I do like those. And then I do take this Probiotic Daily Women's Care Vitamins. And then I do take Ritual Vitamins and then a Multivitamin, but I'm going to take that when I get back. Um, but I'm just going to rush. So I take two of the Beam Revive. Damn, I'm running out. And then, like I said, this helps with swelling and stuff. If you watch my giveaway video, I talked about it. But these are really good for that. Like inflammation and stuff like that. So let me just shake this up real quick. I just put the drops in. Y'all, this really is a lifestyle. Like I'm telling you, like this shit is not a game. Ugh, I hate taking pills. Ugh. But yeah, y'all, it's going to be a busy day. So I hope you can keep up. So... So let's get to it. I do want to stop and get a coffee because I know I'm going to have a long ass day. But let's just get it done and get to it. We got to do it. Okay, y'all. So I just, I was in between appointments, so I really couldn't um, vlog. So I just got my lashes filled. They're really full. And then I got my nails done. They're so cute. They're like a matte um french tip i need some lotion please don't mind that um but yeah so i'm really stressed right now because i wanted to get a ponytail before i leave to miami tomorrow and um homegirl's sick i think she got kobe um so she was like oh my god i'm so sick and I was like, that's fine. Um, but now I gotta figure out who's gonna do my fucking hair. And I'm trying to see if somebody can do it in Miami, but Homegirl's not responding. Um, I don't know, like, she ain't posting nothing. Like, she barely follow nobody. She only follows the shade room. Like, what the fuck? Um, so I'm trying to see if somebody can do it here real quick. Um, so, yeah, I'm just stressed. I need some food. Um, I'm probably gonna go get a salad and I want some coffee. Um, so I'm about to go do that and get my feet done. So yeah, I'm stressed. I'm trying to figure out who's gonna do my hair. Um, but yeah, let me just figure my life out because I'm annoyed. Y'all, so these are what I wear under my ha Just this, this. I'm trying to hurry up because I plan to get in here. So. so I found somebody to do my hair, so I had to come go to the beauty supply store and get this hair. This is 28 inches. Baby, she's gonna be long as fuck. She told me to get three packs. So yeah, this should be good like that. So yeah, let's do it. Y'all, so I had to come to back to the mall because I'm trying to find some cute, I hope y'all can hear me. I'm trying to find some cute blue sunglasses to go with one of my swimsuits. This, too rough, but I don't want, I, don't, I think it's too blue. These are a quay. I think that's how you say quay. This is fire. See, I like big oversized glasses because my head is big. So, but let me see. You know you gotta pose when they like. <laughs> but I don't know. These are these aren't giving me what I wanted to. Well, I don't know because my hair not done. Y'all know y'all when y'all hair not done, it's not giving you what you wanted to. It's not giving you. Hello. I'm not finding anything here. I'm low key finna go to the man in the middle of the mall to see if I can find something. But these Gucci glasses are cute. They black. Yeah, can I see these? These black ones. Yeah. I don't really wear aviators. Thank you. Hi. 
How much are these? Do these look good on me? I feel like they look too tight. I'm going I'm going to Miami tomorrow and I need a pair of blue sunglasses. <laughs>